okay in this video i'm gonna show you what is the value of ln of i well ln is only valid for positive number in the real world right but we can extend the idea of ln function in the complex world uh, now suppose ln i equal to something okay let's call ln i equal to a fish now we need to find out what is the value of this fish right so first we will isolate this uh, this i so for that we are going to take E as a base on both sides. So, E to the ln of I equal to E to the that fish. Right? So, here E and ln will cancel out. So, you will get I equal to E to the that fish. Well, now take a look at the Euler's identity. From Euler's identity, we know that e to the i theta is equal to cosine of theta plus i times sine of theta. Right? Well, okay. So, now let theta equal to pi over 2. Okay? So, e to the i times pi over 2 equal to cos of pi over 2 plus i times sin of pi over 2 now cos of pi over 2 equal to 0 and sin of pi over 2 equal to 1 so this is equal to just only i so instead of i you can write it okay so here we are going to write this instead of i so it will be equal to e to the i pi over 2 equal to e to the that fish now this uh, now on both side both side we have e as the base and the exponent are different so the exponent must be equal so here is the deal e uh, sorry the fish equal to i pi over 2 well actually the fish is ln of i so ln of i equal to i phi over 2 now uh, this is only a solution for ln of i because look at here uh, co cosine and sine both are periodic function so you can uh, you can add 2 and phi where n belongs to uh, z every time and you will get the same value so this is also equal to i and by using this you can find all the general solution for ln of i okay you can do it yourself give it a try well can you do it in some other way now we are going to find the value of ln of i in another method in uh, we are going to use the idea of polar form so let's see how we can do that now suppose a complex number x equal to a plus b i that's the that's the standard form of a complex number now suppose this is the real axis and this is the imaginary axis or complex axis this is the i axis okay now here if the point x is here then from here to here the value is a and from here to here the value is b so here x equal to a plus b i and you can uh, express x in another way in fuller form too 
सपोज दिस इज आर एंड दिस इज थेटा ओके सो फ्रॉम हियर कोसाइन ऑफ थीटा इक्वल टू ए ओवर आर सो ए इक्वल टू आर टाइम्स कोसाइन ऑफ थीटा एंड सेम वे यू विल गेट बी इक्वल टू आर टाइम्स साइन ऑफ थीटा नाउ लेट्स सी हाउ वी कैन एक्सप्रेस एक्स विथ फोलर फॉर्म सो एक्स इक्वल टू ए प्लस बी आई दैट मीन्स ए इज आर टाइम्स कोसाइन थीटा प्लस बी मीन्स आर टाइम्स साइन थीटा एंड वी हैव ए आई नाउ फैक्टर आउट आर सो आर टाइम्स कोसाइन थीटा प्लस आई साइन थीटा राइट सो यू विल गेट आर टाइम्स नाउ लुक हियर दिस इज दर्स आइडेंटिटी राइट दिस इज इक्वल टू e to the i theta okay so this is equal to x now what we are going to do is take ln function both side now from property of ln function we know that uh, ln of a b equal to ln of a plus ln of b right so here ln of x equal to ln of r plus ln of e to the i theta now ln and e will cancel out so this is equal to ln of r plus i theta okay now we are going to express ln i in such a form so for i you can write it as 0 plus 1 i okay and it looks like this suppose this is 0 and this is 1 so i is right here here the here r is equal to 1 and the angle is pi over 2 but as i said earlier you can add 2 and 5 every time you can go either this dire direction or this direction that doesn't matter but uh, for simplicity i'm just going to take i over 2 not more than that so now let's see what is ln of i so take a look here ln of x is equal to that so ln of i equal to ln of here r is equal to 1 plus i theta so i times the theta equal to pi over 2 right so ln 1 is just 0 plus pi i over 2 and again ln of i equal to pi i over 2 but you can find all the solution by adding 2 and 5 every time you can do it yourself give it a try that's it guys thanks a lot for watching